Good day, ladies and gentlemen. My name is CY2Squared, and you're watching Securo Shadows Die Twice. In the last video, we ended up right here. We took out these enemies. And I stopped the video. I stopped the recording. Little did I know, 50 feet away, there was another Buddha sculptor. We head down this way. You're going to be encountered by a long-armed centipede. And unfortunately, I did not get that recorded, but... Just know that I was a ninja and it was a really cool fight and I got a prayer bead for it. This is a dead end. It loops you back around, but there's lots of good items down there. It's going to be a ton of poison lizards and some of the smaller centipedes. Just make sure you have your shuriken equipped so you can uh, target those lizards and take them out easy. Now, I have been through here and I got ganked. I got ganked by some of the owl guys. You're going to want... If you don't have the Withered Red Gourd, make sure to equip Dowsing Powder. They can take you out very quickly. When you first come out on the bridge, you're going to be knocked off the bridge by the Great Serpent. You're going to land in the water. Look how much health damage that does. That is ridiculous. Whenever he does a perilous attack, you see the sign come up. Use circle if you're playing PlayStation to dodge. There's a nice hidey spot right here. And we're going to head over in this direction. Now, I haven't done this whole area. I'm just telling you what I know thus far. And you're going to encounter your first Buddha sculptor idol down here in the sunken valley. This place is, it reminds me of somewhat of Planet of the Apes, and you'll see why real soon. That's right, we need to go up this way. Wait for it, there he is. He will try to drop down on your head, so be careful. Oh, he gave me a balloon of wealth. Cool. Things don't get really complicated quite yet. But they do have weapons. Some of the monkeys have weapons, and some of them even have rifles. That's why I have the loaded umbrella equipped, just in case they shoot at me. I believe the yellow is one of the riflemen, the rifle monkeys, I guess I should say. And here we have another one. You're going to want to take him out because he does have a gun. There are plenty of items around here. A few of them I've already picked up. Not that one. Don't underestimate these monkeys. They're a lot tougher than the ones you fought before. And we got another rifleman, so that's definitely a good thing. Some contact medicine. What what exactly is contact medicine? Uh, a weak poison status abnormality is inflicted. Oh, so it gives you some poison resistance. Same way vaccines work. Introduce a little bit of the virus and your body builds an immunity. There goes another rifleman. Let's see if we can sneak up on him. What do we 
have here? Oh, okay. Over here is where we're going to have... There are actually two of them. Make them come to you. They're tough. They're really tough to fight together because they do a lot of fire damage. Now he didn't seem that tough. But when they are together, they are... It's a nightmare. That's actually... They're what killed me the last time I came through. Take some more weathered... Withered red gourd. See if I can get a backstab on him. Nothing over here. Oh, oh, he turned around again. Not quite sure what that was all about. Looks like we're just going to have to fight this guy straight up. He's not going anywhere. Unless we can... Yeah, more than one way to skin an owl. <laughs> okay. Now I think I want to take out... Where'd Monkey Boy go? He disappeared on us. There's an entire clan of monkeys over there. I took... I, I took them on, I think... Oh, jeez, I don't know. Maybe killed all of them, but three or four. Quite honestly, I don't really think there's anything over there. I'm not quite sure if it's even worth messing with them. I believe there was an item in the back. I don't even think it's really worth messing with them. Um, they inevitably will gang up on you and beat the holy piss out of you, so... I mean, that's up to you. If you feel like taking on a bunch of monkeys, go for it. This is why I like having the monocular equipped okay so the lady didn't die she moved I gave her ass some rice and then all she did was gave me a riddle about a puppet and a kite and I am gonna figure that riddle out eventually first I want to go talk to her we'll go ahead and hit up the sculptor sculpture Sculptor's Idol found. Okay, so I've been saying it wrong. Sculptor's Idol. I call it a Buddha Idol. Ah, fruits of the serpent. Yes, there are two kinds. One is fresh, the other is dried. Over there. The dried fruit is over there. 
past the poison swamp, down the nest. That's where you'll find it. What are you talking about? Dried fruit? Eh? Something troubling you? Rice for me. That's the way. Rice, I say. If something's not right, bless me with rice any time. Have any rice? Rice from the divine child. Okay. Well, let's let's go get her some rice. Whoa, what in the what is that? Oh my god. It looks like the thing from the Star Wars movie. Okay. What are those things called? The the blizzard monkeys? <laughs> uh the ice monkeys, oh, the, the, the the abominable snowman. Okay, uh, let's go to the inner sanctum. We can finish up this video by getting her some rice, giving it to her, and seeing what she says to us. Maybe she'll stop speaking in riddles and give us a direct answer, but I doubt it. This is the Divine Child. <clears throat> oh, Shinobi of the Divine Air, I awaited your return. Please, take this rice. Thank you. Bless us with bountiful harvest. And... We get some more rice. The flavor grows richer with each bite and is sure to raise one's spirits. You Not... have my gratitude. Of course. Rice is a precious thing. Remember to chew properly before swallowing. Now I'm not sure how many times you Thank can you for visiting. actually request rice from the Divine Child. I've only done it twice. And we can travel back to the sunken valley. See what the old hag says. Is anybody else surprised that the brand Champion is now back in style? When I was a kid, Champion was huge. Everybody wore it. And then it kind of just faded out. They used to have a license to make like basketball jerseys and probably even baseball jerseys. And then they lost that license. They kind of went away. And now all of a sudden it's popular again. Ah, fruits of the serpent. Yes, one is fresh. The other is dried over there. The dried fruit is over there, past the poison swamp, down the nest. That's where you'll find it. What are you talking about? Dried... Eh? Rice for me. That's the way. Rice, I say. If something's not right, bless me with rice any time. Give rice? Give some rice. Oh, oh, there's no doubt. This is the Divine Child's rice. Oh, thank heavens. Thank heavens. Tell me what you see. Mm. Ew. If it's dried fruit you're after, oh, become a trainer of monkeys. Make the monkey dance. And he'll be eaten. I love so sweet. If it's dried fruit you're after, become a trainer of monkeys. Make the monkey dance, and he'll be eaten. Make a monkey dance? What does it mean? Make a monkey dance and he'll be eaten. Okay, so more more riddles that we need to solve, which we'll we'll do it. We'll get there. I have no doubt. I'm gonna slowly unravel all these secrets. 
Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I always respond to comments, even if it takes me a couple days or weeks. Sometimes my notifications mess up and I just don't even see them. So don't feel offended or anything if I don't get right back to you. Eventually I'll scroll through the comment section and see what's going on. And uh, tell me what you think about the Sunken Valley. It's, it's kind of a different place, but I'm digging it. How do you guys feel about it? I'll talk to you in the next episode. Bye-bye.